Tonight, a Grand Valley State University student says her unexpected vet bills are adding up. Tippy was adopted from Cobra's Canines last month, where the owner is now charged with animal cruelty and neglect. 13 On Your Side's Micah Cho talked to Tippy's owner tonight about the dog's illnesses. Let's see. So I was about 90 for the antibiotics in the first vet visit. I just spent 200 two days ago, and then I will be spending probably another 200 to get him neutered and to get one more vaccine. Veterinarian bills are starting to add up for Laura Muscati. So all we know for sure is that he had the upper respiratory infection and that he's dealing with tapeworms right now, but he is on his um, tapeworm medication, so hopefully that'll take care of that. The Grand Valley State University student says along with paying rent and grocery bills, vet costs for a dog she thought was healthy are starting to become difficult. She says her Corgi Chihuahua mixed dog Tippy came from Lisa Cover's rescue, Cover's Canines. Online it said he was fully house trained, crate trained, up to date on all of his vaccines, dewormed, all of that, but we soon found out that that wasn't true. On top of vet costs, Muscati paid the $340 adoption fee for Tippy, meeting Cobra at the same spot as others who adopted their dogs from the rescue, PetSmart and Muskegon. <laughs> On January 30th, the Norton Shores Police Department seized almost 80 dogs from Cobra's canines, police calling the conditions the dogs were living in deplorable. Cobra was also arrested and charged with animal cruelty last week, Hearing about Cobra's arrest and the conditions the dogs were living in, startling to Muscati. My heart honestly sank. After reading that, I kind of did my own digging and I saw the other people had similar stories and I was like, I just felt very like betrayed by that because this is like, it's like taking care of a little child and I just can't believe anyone would do anything like that. However, Muscati says no matter what, she's still planning on providing the medical care needed for Tippy. Obviously, I'm paying them because I I have to do them and like he needs to get revaccinated and I want him to be better, but it is definitely expensive as a college student. That was Micah Cho reporting.